Aaron has pulled a double cross and the rumbling is about to go down. Up Wedding Nerdigans, this is the one only Packer Girl 89 and today's Manga Nerdigan Live Reaction video is going to be for Attack on Titan Chapter 121. So first off, uh, for those of you that don't know, I did go to Crunchyroll Expo this past weekend and um, even though I found a, a little Japanese Kenma in Mitsuki, which is something I've been looking for for a very, very long time, I did not see any, any little little almonds any little band presto almonds are, are like that big i was very very saddened by that but on the bright side of things i did meet attack on titan manga readers which was really really nice because last year um there were like no manga readers and this year there was manga readers and also attack on titan got a shout out at the godansha um manga's weird panel so there's that too um as well uh but anyway um Last chapter of Attack on Titan was very, very interesting because we found out that, you know, Aaron pulled a double cross on Zeke and also that the girl that we saw basically revive Zeke after he got his ass whooped by Levi was none other than Amir herself, which is something I think we all kind of figured um, that's who she was. But it looks like the rumbling's about to go down. Oh, shit. Oh, this is going to be very, very interesting. Let's get to this chapter and see what happens next. Uh, you're already nine years old, huh? Grisha loves you and is raising you freely. You were never brainwashed by your father, and that's why I said it's useless, no matter how many years I spend wandering within my father's memories. Yeah, Zeke, you can, you could take Aaron through all his memories, kind of like what's going on with the, with the, um, Rin in Ao No Exorcist. You can do all that shit, but unlike Rin, where Rin's, like, kind of breaking down. Oh, well, he broke down for a second. He, he recovered, uh, this month. Uh, Aaron is just like, dude, you can do whatever the fuck you want. You ain't gonna change my mind about what I want to do. If that's the case, uh, why did you betray me? Uh, you inherited the Titan without being told anything by father, and yet you still continue to fight along the lines of his wishes. Aaron, why do you refuse to end this fight? What do you intend to do with the Founder's power? I... Ever since I was born, I've been me. And chapter 121 is titled Future Memories. What's being pursued is freedom. I used to think you and I were the same, but I was wrong. If other people are going to steal my freedom, I'm going to steal theirs. Father did not intend on letting that happen to me. I've always been that way ever since I was born. Ever since you were born? The pathetic little brother you wish for is nowhere to be found. Neither is the little brother who wishes who oh my god, we're gonna crap. Neither is the little brother who lives in the perfect circumstances to be able to share your emotional wounds. The only person uh, who could be found here is a man who can vow his confidence only by continuing to deny his father's desire to restore restore Eldia, a pathetic man who is a slave to his dead father. Ooh Aaron called you out, Zeke. Aaron called you out, because the thing that Zeke is doing is Zeke is like a slave to the memory of his father and it it's all has to do with the indoctrination that Zeke went through when um he was younger uh remember how uh, Zeke betrayed his parents yeah that indoctrination I'm talking about but yeah that's what it, oh hopefully Zeke is gonna wake the fuck up if that's the case, this man should be thank thankful to his father. That father's actions opened his son's eyes and saved the world from the crisis of Eldia. In a sense, the one who saved the world is that father. Don't you think that's ironic? Don't you think that's ironic, Aaron? Oh, Aaron seeing him, reliving him, um, Aaron putting the scarf on uh, Mikasa. Are you okay, Aaron? The power of the founding titan is in my hands. I can carry out the plan of euthanasia at any time. However, I'm not going to abandon you. Just like, um... Uh, K-Saver never abandoned me. Before saving the world, I want to save you. Humanity has not perished. He wants to leave behind an impressive uh, final message. Oh, there it is. Aaron, uh, Aaron said that he wants to join the Survey Corps. What are you thinking? Do you know just how much of humanity has died from going outside the walls? I, I know. Aaron, why do you want to venture outside? I want to know what the world outside is like. I don't want to spend my whole life inside the walls without knowing a single thing. Also, if there is no one to continue from this point, the lives of everyone who died before would go to waste. Hold on, Grisha. Convince Aaron not to join. Aaron, when I return the basement, um, uh, when I return the basement that I've kept secret all this time, I'll show you inside. Really? Mm. Oh, that look on Grisha's face. I'm an Eldian who came from beyond the walls, a subject of Amir just like you. 
king of the walls, please, you must kill the, kill the titans attacking the walls at once before my wife and my children, before the people of the walls are eaten. We must not run from our sins. For us, the subjects of Amir, uh, judgment day has come. When faced with enormous power, humans are far too weak. This is what I came to realize during that, the tragedy that was the Great Titan War. Someone must protect the power of the Titans from the hands of humanity. If the Founder's power falls into it, uh, the hands of a weakling once again, the world will turn to hell once more. In order to save the world, we must accept our sins. There is nothing we can do except perish. I feel like I'd get along well with that girl. Yeah, seriously, Zeke, you totally would. Uh, but this family will all be slaughtered right here by Grisha. You said that you've seen this memory before, haven't you? And felt a deep sense of disappointment towards, uh, towards your father. Was that also a lie? Oh, no, that ain't a lie. My house is right next to the wall that was destroyed. That's where my wife, my son, and my daughter live. The people who live in these walls have no idea about the crimes their ancestors committed because you stole their memories. Ooh, do you think that simply being eaten by titans without knowing the reason why is supposed to be some sort of atonement? No, no matter how much we reflect on the matter, we are unable to bring back the Eldian lives that have uh, already been taken. However, having the lives of people outside the walls be taken is something we are able to avoid. If we simply feign ignorance and accept the wrath of this world, us Eldian people will die and that will be the end of it. Now, I actually had a really interesting conversation um, with, uh, <laughs> um, with someone who's actually half Japanese and half Jew and like it just is the conversation I had with them is just making me think of, of this because remember um, what was said basically in regards to the Eldians being basically being Jews um, another thing before I forget this was said at um, the uh, um, uh, Mike McFarlane panel the dub voice panel is that apparently in the anime and I didn't get to find out if it was confirmed um, by the mangaka or not is uh, is that the narrator in the anime is actually an elder version of Armin so if that has been if that if for those of you that know if it has been confirmed or not please let me know um, if that is in relation to the manga as well because I tried to find out but um, uh, but I n didn't get the chance to ask uh, Mike McFarlane so and I didn't get the uh, the chance to um, ask George either Ooh, Aaron trying to persuade me is useless also even if you attempt to steal the founding titan from me you are I got it the fact that I cannot use the power of the founding titan eh? the nine titans all have their distinct qualities including the attack titan who dwells within me for some time that's the successor of the attack titan has not um, obeyed anybody I know the reason why it was all in order to fight against the king's self-righteousness that's right um, for this moment everybody was led by these memories the attack titan is even able to peer into the memories of its future successors in other words, it's, it has the ability to foresee the future. Holy crap! It can predict the future. So, all this shit that's going down. Dude, Grisha be trolling, yo. This is all going according to Grisha's plan. This is all going according to Grisha's plan. The future? What is the meaning of this? Aaron? The distinct quality of the attack titan that's i also know that you were not aware of this the power of the founding titan cannot be fully utilized due to the vow of renouncing war even whoa wait a minute the power of the founding titan cannot be fully utilized due to the vow of renouncing war wow even as members of the royal family that goes for you too right here i'll devour the founding titan and wipe out the royal blood that is the future um uh, which i have decided Oh no, I can't, for me to kill children, I, I'm a doctor who saves people. Foolish, Grisha definitely stole the founding. He annihilated his entire family, that's how it should be. There's no way that the past could, um, could change. What? Okay, we had something like this go down in Maho Shoujo site, but I'm ho hopefully this is gonna be, it's gonna be executed better here. Um, what are you doing, Frida? Kill that man quick! The Founding is invincible! Kill him! There's no way we can let that man live anymore! Kill him quick, sister! Uh, or our paradise will be destroyed! Frida, protect everyone! What are you doing? Stand, Dad! Have you forgotten what- Wait, what? Dad? Oh yeah, that's Aaron. Okay. I was like, wait a minute. What are you doing? Stand, Dad! Have you forgotten what you came here to do? It's payback, right? For your little sister who got eaten by dogs. For your comrades from the restoration. For Dina. We need to keep moving 
um, for Kruger. We need to keep moving forward to avenge them, even if we die, even after we die. This is the story that you started, right, Dad? Ooh. Oh my gosh. I killed even the little children, crushed them with this hand, the feeling of my hand. Aaron, I killed the Reese family. Everyone except the father. Is this okay? Are you happy with this? With this, will Aldia really be saved? Why won't you show me everything? The wall being destroyed. The Dale will be destroyed. If Carla will be safe, was there really no other way? You're there, aren't you, Zeke? In the future, your wish won't come true. The one that will come true is Aaron's. Remember, this we, it was just revealed that we could that um, Grisha could see the future, and that actually makes a lot of sense. Um, and you know what? It also is kind of making me think of uh, of what's going on in Boku with uh, Deku and Boku no Hero Academia. It really is because because um, Deku was has been able to like uh, communicate with his predecessors. Though it's a different with it's different for uh, for Deku. He's communicating with his predecessors, um, whereas with um, Grisha, it's with the future, which is it, it's really I think this is really fascinating, and I love it. What what are you saying? I saw Aaron's future memories, but to think that's such a, such a for a terrifying thing like that to happen, Zeke, is that you? You grew up so much. I'm sorry I was a terrible father. I made you suffer always. I I, I think we know what Grisha's talking about in that terrible future. It's the rumbling. The rumbling is is, is totally confirmed right now. Zeke, I love you. Oh my god. Oh god, I'm not gonna cry right now. I wish we could have spent more time together. God, Dad, Zeke, uh, stop Aaron. Ugh. You still haven't seen when Dad got eaten by me. You, you made it so that Dad would fight against the king of the walls in the world. Is that what you did? If the attack titan really has the ability to, surpa to surpass time, it would be possible to influence the past by only showing Grisha's, uh, Grisha memories convenient for you. Uh, Grisha was hesitating over um, his duty as a restorationist because having seen your memories he knew that even if he stole the founding he would have been unable to use that power but he was made to steal the founding by you <gasps> because he saw the future saw something in the future that you showed him I'm grateful to you brother thanks to you bringing me inside father's memories I've got this path here here now oh my god Aaron fist fucking played you Zeke oh my god Aaron be trolling yo Aaron, it's not Grisha that trolling. It is Aaron. Aaron is fucking trolling. This is all going according to Aaron's plan. Holy shit, Aaron is trolling like a mofo. Not my wish, but your wish will come true. That's what he said. Yeah, I saw it four years ago through father's memories. I saw my memories from the future. That scenery. Founder Amir, take away from all of Amir's subjects their ability to reproduce. The coronet. Grisha, he told me to stop you, that he regrets having followed you. I don't know what future you might have seen in Father's memories, but you must have not seen all of it, right? Like how you didn't know you couldn't use the Founder's powers here. You are still helpless. Ah! It's useless, Aaron. No one in this world has been capable of, of stopping the Founder Amir when she moves. Towards ruin, she moves. Oh my god, so this is really interesting. This chapter was really, this chapter was a total mindfuck because we had a manipulation of the past going on here. Aaron, this is all going according to Aaron's plan. Dude, Aaron's trolling, yo. But Amir's moving, dude, Amir moving is scary. Well, that is not good because you know what Amir moving means? Amir moving means like what I think the rumbling is. I think, I think no matter what, and I still believe this is what Grisha saw, the rumbling's going to go down, period. The rumbling's going to go down. Um, and I think only Aaron, and Aaron's going to stop Amir from doing what Zeke wants. So I'm very curious what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this uh, channel alive so I can keep bringing you more Attack on Titan content, there's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to my, um, PayPal, Patreon, GoFundMe, purchase something off my Amazon wishlist. All that's in the description box below. Also, uh, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, from me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later.